Alright class, today we're gonna be learning how to speak Mexican. You're gonna need to know how to speak Mexican because one day you're gonna find yourself at a Mexican restaurant and the waiter's gonna bring you your food and say hot plate but you're gonna touch the plate anyway and burn your hand because you didn't understand what they said because they were speaking Mexican. So we're gonna learn how to speak Mexican. Any questions, Kras? Um, it's not called speaking Mexican, it's called speaking Spanish. Spanish, Mexican, same thing, Cody. What do they speak in Mexico? Mexican. See, it's that simple. Okay, well, what do they speak in Spain? Mexican. Wh what about Puerto Rico or Cuba? <sighs> they all speak Mexican, Cody, but we'll call it Spanish for you. You wrote Spanish on the board. All right, Kras, now I'll pay attention to Cody. He dumb, he not know Mexican. Anyway, class, does anyone know how to say hello in Spanish? What about you, smartass? The Spanish word for hello is hola. No, that's how you say hello in Hawaiian. I asked how you say hello in Mexican. I mean, Spanish. Yes. All right, so the way you say hello in Spanish is El hello -o. El hello -o, class. El hello -o. Guys, it's not even how you say hello in Spanish. Very good, Crass. Now that you all know how to say hello in Spanish, we're going to learn how to say bye in Spanish. The way you say bye in Spanish is... Adios. El bayo. God damn it. So, el hello, oh, Crass. Then when we leave, we say el bayo. What? Are you kidding me? You can't just add L and O to the beginning and end of every word and say it's Spanish now. All right, Crass. Now that you know how to say by in Spanish, you're probably wondering how do you say this by in Spanish. Well, it's very similar to this by, except this one is El Bayo. So, the difference between El Bayo and El Bayo is this by, you're gonna say it while you're waving. So, El Bayo and this by, you're gonna say it with money in your hand, like you're gonna buy something. El Bayo. What? What if you don't have any arms? That doesn't even make sense. Well, you better have arms if you go on to Mexico, Cody, or else no one's gonna understand you. All of this, pointless if you don't have arm. Arm is very important to the Mexican language. So, this buy and this buy, no one's gonna understand you if you don't have arm. Because they're gonna think you're trying to buy something and leave at the same time. Anyway, Crass. So, now that you know how to say Buy as in El Bayo and buy as in you're gonna buy something. Now you're probably wondering how do you say this buy? This buy is like this book was written by. The way you say this buy in Mexican is. Let me guess, is it El Bayo? Ah, no, very close, Cody, very close, but they different. The way you say buy in Spanish is. El Bayo. That's what I just said. Well, what you do with your hands is very important, Cody, because the way you say this by is El Bayo, and the way you say this by is El Bayo. You have to have money in your hand, Cody. All right, and then the way you say this by El Bayo, you must have book in your hand. See, book is written El Bayo, Dr. Seuss. Understand? No. Why don't we just learn regular Spanish? This is very complicated. I know, I know, Crass. Mexican can be very confusing. So let me use all three buys in a sentence to help you understand. So what you're gonna do is, you're gonna walk into the library and say, El hero -o, Mrs. Librarian. I would like to El Bayo a book that was written El Bayo Dr. Seuss. She's gonna take your money, and now you own book. But before you leave, you're gonna set the book down and say, El Bayo, you cannot say El Bayo while holding book in your hand, or else you look like this. El Bayo, El Bayo, like, who wrote this fucking book? You know who wrote the fucking book. It says Dr. Seuss on the side of the book. So you have to put the book down and say, El Bayo, then you can pick the book back up and leave. Any questions, class? Yeah, I'm dropping out of this school. All right, class, we're running out of time. So we're gonna go through these last three very quickly. All right, the next word we have is name. How you say name in Mexican is, Nemo. 
Bingo was his name of very famous Spanish song. B I N G O. And bingo was his name of. The next word we have is yes. Does anyone know how to say yes in Spanish? Si. Sí. Come on, guys, I thought you were smarter than that. The way you say yes in Mexican is. El yeso. Everybody understand? Alright, the last word is no. Does anyone know how to say no in Spanish? Oh, I got it now. It's el no o. What? What? What kind of Spanish is that? Cody, you are so dumb. You have a lot of Spanish to be learning. The way you say no in Spanish is no. No mean no in all languages. How you be so stupid, El No? <laughs> Crappy, dumb! What, uh, oh, okay, oh yeah, that's fair. I was just putting L and O at the beginning and end of every word like you were. Oh, come on, Cody, this is getting really easy. Spanish is easy. Screw off, Junior. All right, Crass, I know some of you had trouble learning your Spanish today, but what I want you to do is tonight go to Mexican restaurant and try to test out your Spanish, see how far along you get. All right, and remember, if they say hot plate, that means Ow, no touch. Do not touch it or else you burn your hand. All right, I know we didn't get to food items today, but remember, burrito and taco are same thing in Mexican. And also, when in doubt, add L and O to the word, and you're probably right. Good luck, Crass. See you tomorrow. Ugh, what a long and exhausting day of school today, Cody. Yeah, I know. It's almost like we didn't learn anything at all. But yes, we did, Cody. We learned Spanish. No, we didn't, Junior. Nothing that he taught us was actually Spanish. But yes, it was, Cody. He's a teacher. He knows what he's talking about. He's an idiot. He doesn't know what he's talking about. And nothing he taught us was real Spanish. Okay, Cody, look, I understand that, you know, we only know English, so learning a new language is going to be hard for us. So I understand hearing another language is going to sound like gibberish. So, yes, Spanish right now doesn't make sense to us, but eventually we're going to speak fluent Spanish, and it's going to make sense. Junior, I've already learned a little bit of Spanish. Yeah, today. W no, no, I mean before today. Like, like earlier today? No, no, I, I mean even earlier than that, like yesterday. W like, no, I didn't learn Spanish yesterday. I learned Spanish like a while back. Like how long? Like, like earlier today? Like a few hours? No, no, not a few. Like like a few years ago. Like, okay, Cody, your time's all messed up. A few years ago? No, like no, you mean no, earlier today. Junior, nothing we just learned today is real Spanish. I promise. Oh, okay, then let's go to the Mexican restaurant and test it out like he wants us to do, and we'll see if it works or not. Junior, we're going to sound stupid. No, we're not. We're going to sound like we're Spanish. <sighs> Fine. All right, let's go, Cody. Oh, man, this is my first time at a Mexican restaurant. This is so cool. Woohoo. Can we go now? Cody, we're not going to leave yet. Our teacher says we have to test out our Spanish at a Mexican restaurant. So we're at a Mexican restaurant. Let's test out our Spanish. Junior, we don't even know real Spanish. Our teacher is an idiot, and we're just going to sound stupid. Cody, we're not going to sound stupid. Is that a real cactus? No, Junior, that's a balloon and a sombrero. And we're going to sound stupid because we're just adding L and O to everything. And besides, I can't even eat Mexican food. It'll tear apart my butthole. Not in a good way. Oh, el hello, senors. I brought you some chips and salsa and queso and salt cream. Welcome to Border Jumping Bean. My name oh, is Burrito Taco Burrito, but you can call me Taco. That is not your real name. El yeso it is, senor. What is your name oh? <sighs> Mi llamo es Cody. What? <sighs> My name oh, is Cody. Oh, bingo was his name oh. What's your name oh, senor? Oh, uh, uh, El Hello O. Oh. My name oh, Junior. Ah, bingo was his name oh. Do you bingos want to order some food? Um, I, I just like to buy a taco and an enchilada. What? Uh, oh, oh, I'm sorry. I, I'd like to el bio a taco and an enchilada. Oh, you're leaving so soon? See you later. No, no I'm not. I'm not leaving. I, I'd like to el bio a taco and an enchilada. Ah, taco and enchilada for Bingo. What about you, Bingo? Oh, uh, I would also. I mean, uh, uh Cody, can I borrow that? Yeah. I would like to el bio a taco and enchilada also. Oh, okay. Two enchilada, two taco, coming right up for the Bingos. Junior, this is ridiculous. Cody, look, we're doing we're doing pretty good with our Spanish. You're, you're killing it with your Spanish. You said you didn't know it, but you're killing it. Junior, this is stupid. This isn't even real Spanish. Cody, let's just eat some nachos. <sighs> All right, bingos, your food is ready. Hot plate. <sighs> ow, fuck. Ow, What's wrong, Cody? I burned my hand on the plate. Well, he said hot plate. That equals ow, no touch. You know that. Well, he touched it, and it didn't hurt him. Here you go, senor. Hot plate. Oh, that's a good point, Cody. I'm going to ask him. Uh, L, excuse me, O. El guanto. El, uh, how O oh, did you O oh, touch the hot plate O oh, without it burning your hand O? Oh! oh! Bingo was his name O. Oh. Did you get your answer, Junior? Did you? 
uh, well, I think it's just really busy. Yeah, that's probably what it is. I can't wait to try this food though. It looks really good. Try yours. Uh, Junior, I said I can't eat it because if I do, I'm gonna have a baby out of my butt. Well, Cody, maybe this is diet. Oh, you know what? Yeah, 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 you're right, Junior. It's probably diet Mexican food. I hadn't thought of that. I guess I'll try it then. Yeah, it might be diet. They might make it like, well, it won't make you sick. Mm, mm, these diet beans are actually really good, Junior. Oh, Cody, you should try this enchilada. It's amazing. Yeah. Uh-oh, uh-oh. What's wrong, Cody? Did you touch the plate again? Did you burn yourself? No, no, Junior. I gotta poop. I gotta poop really, really bad. Uh oh, well, then use the bathroom, you weirdo. No, no, Junior. I never use public bathrooms. Cody never poops in public. Cody pooping in public? Never gonna happen. I never pull a CPP. You never pull a CPP? No. Well, you poop in private, right? Well, well yeah. So that's a CPP. Cody poops in private. Well, well it's a CPP, but it, it's not the same kind of CPP. Look, it doesn't matter, Junior. I have to poop. We need to leave right now. So you want me to get the check? Yes, please. Where's the waiter at? Uh, waiter, uh. Waiter! Waiter, get over here! Did you need something, Bingos? Yes, I have to poop. I, I need to check right now. Oh, we're actually running a special today. If you El Bio this book, then your meal is free. What? I don't want to buy a book. I just want to pay for my dinner. Well, that's a good deal, Cody. If, if you buy the book, your meal is free. We basically ate for free. Well, it's not free if I'm buying the book, Junior. But the meal is free, senor. Yeah, it's, it's a good deal, Cody. Well, okay, okay, fine. I will buy your stupid book. What? What? Oh, I'm sorry. I will El Bio your book. Oh, you're leaving so soon without paying? What? You dine in ditch? No, no, for God's sake. Look, I, I, I will El Bio your book. Oh, okay. Glad you're doing business with you, senor. Okay, okay. Can, we, can we go now, Junior? Uh, Cody, I say bye to him. Okay. El Bio. Dr. Seuss. Ooh. Oh, what's up, Cody? Oh, Cody, you said bye while holding the book, didn't you? Uh, are you farting, Cody? Ooh, ooh, junior, Junior, I, I pooped in my panties. What? I pooped in my panties, Junior. I have I have mesh panties, and I just made Play-Doh spaghetti in my pants. Uh, uh, well, Cody, look, at least we learned Spanish and you and you bought a book, just like the teacher taught us. So you do know Spanish, Cody, you learned Spanish. Ooh, oh, God, it won't El stop. Pico cayo. Oh, God, it won't stop, Junior. Just keep pooping. <laughs> oh, man, what a weird dream. Oh, man, I'm gonna call Cody. Come on, Cody, answer. Hello? Cody, I just had the weirdest dream. I had a dream that we were in school and we learned Spanish and then we went to a Mexican restaurant and, and you bought a book and then you pooped your pants. That wasn't a dream, Junior. That was earlier today. I'm still on the toilet. Now hang up so I can finish reading Green Eggs and Ham. <sighs> I do not like them, Sam. I am. I do not like Green Eggs and Ham.